Scale of amputations in Ukraine reaches World War I level. Since the beginning of the Russian military aggression, the number of Ukrainians left without one or more limbs has reached 20 to 50,000, which is comparable to the scale of amputations during the First World War, according to the Wall Street Journal. Due to the length of time required to register patients following an operation, the actual number may be higher. In fact, after being injured, some people don't have their limbs amputated for weeks or months. The outlet, citing estimates by the Hoop Foundation charity, notes that 200,000 people were seriously injured during the war, while amputations are frequently necessary in about 10% of major injuries. The Wall Street Journal also indicates that the prosthesis are not cheap, with some prices reaching 50,000 euros. At the same time, the Ukrainian authorities pay the wounded up to 20,000 euros. Civilians who are injured find it difficult to afford treatment. The publication recalls that during World War I, 41,000 Britons and 67,000 Germans required amputations. It is noted that fewer than 2,000 US veterans of the Afghanistan and Iraq invasions had amputations. Ukraine's government didn't immediately respond to a request for comment about the figures. Kyiv has kept precise casualty statistics secret so as not to demoralize the population. But even as a rough estimate, the number casts light on the staggering human cost of Russia's 17-month onslaught, a cost that will linger for decades as a generation of disabled persons returns to civilian life.